Omaha couple started scouring estate sales a few years ago. Today, their business is a full-fledged Omaha stop for modern furniture. Lindsay Thies is at Hutch in Midtown Crossing. Lindsay, looks like you're comfortable there. Jen, I am just relaxing. It has been such a tough day. Let me tell you, I'm kicking up my feet. I'm hanging out with the co-owners of Hutch and one of their makers, Jeremy. So this is such a cool story, Jen. You know, when you think of some of the furniture that you're seeing, it's kind of that big city feel, but they still have that warm down home Midwest touch, very Omaha, right? So this started a couple years ago and it has really been a dream come true for these two owners. Take a look. As the sign is placed and the final touches are plumped and polished, oh the delight is the story in the details inside the 4,300 square foot space of Hutch. It started about two years ago when Omaha's Brandon Breed and Nick Huff's dates took them to the thrift store instead of the coffee shop. So we found all of our stuff uh, mostly from estate sales. It, so Thursday through Saturday, getting up at like 4 to 5 a.m. to be the first person in line to, you know, rush to that piece of furniture that you saw. And the two with a passion for pops of color, clean lines, and a minimalist look found themselves buying more modern furniture than they needed. As a hobby, the two began selling online. Then in June 2013, a small store in the old market. A few months later, a bigger space, but still a modest 900 square feet in Midtown Crossing. Like we Googled modern furniture Omaha, and if you do that, the first thing that pops up is this website that's dedicated to people taking car trips down to Ikea and picking up furniture and bringing it back. The two thought it was time to skip the trip somewhere else and bring that style here. His name is Peter Kales, and his business is called Measure Cut Cut, and he makes these all from hand. They're wooden and ceramic hot air balloons. This new space is four times the size of their old one. And mirroring to the local community that has supported them throughout the two years, they're featuring about 20 different Omaha entrepreneurs. Her name is Kira Nam Green. She did a residency at the Bemis. As the success continues to pour in for these young store owners, 31 and 28 respectively, they hope others will be inspired to take their own stake in the Omaha economy. And as far as those 4 a.m. estate sales. As soon as things slow down here, I'm going to be back at it, like hunting. And back out here live at Hutch in Midtown Crossing, I'm here with Jeremy. You are one of the, the local makers and the local artisans that they feature here. Mm -hmm. And I love this. We're sitting in the living room, and I was putting my feet up earlier on this beautiful table that you designed. And did you build it as well? Yes. Yes, so yeah, tell uh, me a little bit about it. Awesome. Very um, cool. Well, this particular one is called the, the Monnier Coffee Table, uh, and it was sort of out of necessity where uh, Brandon and Nick needed actually something to fit the space, and so we designed it from that standpoint. Is this concrete, too? This it, looks like concrete. It is concrete. Um, it's just, uh, it's actually regular run-of-the-mill Home Depot concrete. Great. So heavy duty. I'm glad I can put my feet up. You absolutely can. And I'm seeing behind us here, too, this, is this a console? What? Tell me about this piece that we're looking at. Uh, this is a television console, uh, which was actually also done as a collaboration with these guys. The, uh, the three of us uh, got together um, uh, in... As a need, they felt like they needed a television console in the store, and so this is really what the three of us came up with, and I implemented it. I <laughs> Wonderful. It's so cool. I love that, that it's, this is what I want to see, and we're sitting here, guys. We're going to have more coming up later on the show in the Hutch, at Hutch, too. Uh, Jen, Jim, we're going to send it back to you. All right, Lindsay, very cool. We appreciate like the, it. Uh, ceramic hot air balloons. Don't you think it'll yeah. look good in the office? You know, I think you should get those. Kind of a highlight, just a few That's of those. That's a little bit of a weather theme. Yeah, it does. Yeah.